Hi everyone, this is Iman and I'm going to show you my bedtime routine. All right, step one, what I like to do before going to bed, I always light up a candle just to, you know, set up the mood. So I use these very nice smell by Mimosa, it's deep teak. So I'm gonna light that up and get some good energy in here. Yeah. Then I love to light some incense. So we're gonna light it up again to bring positive energy. <laughs> and as you can see today, I don't have that much of a makeup look on. I have a little bit of foundation on, a little bit of mascara. I was running around all day. So I'm gonna start with the Silk Radiance by Epicurrent. It's a three-in-one cleansing oil. And what I love about it, it's super silky and juicy. The texture of it is a little oily. So I'm gonna rub it into my hands and gently massage it into the skin. I honestly love everything that's kind of oily and hydrating. So this is a great way to take all the makeup off. I never sleep in makeup. I like try to, I mean, it depends when I'm, when I had like a really crazy day at work and I, I'm tired, sometimes it happened, but normally I don't because I think it's just not good for the skin. So even when you're tired, make sure to wash your skin. And I like to double cleanse. Um, so we, we're gonna, as you can see, I'm gonna do the oil part first. So I'm gonna wash that off. One second. All right, oh, great. <laughs> so I'm gonna use a towel to kind of wipe my face off. And as I said before, we're gonna do a double cleanse. And this is one of my favorite products. It's the Deep Clean Detox Cleanser from Osmosis. Do a little bit of that. Again, massage it in, especially around the eyes. Take all the mascara off. I like to get the neck in as well. Most things I've learned about skincare, I would say from my mom, for the people that don't know, I'm Moroccan Egyptian and my mom is Moroccan and she, I call her the herb doctor because she really knows everything about the natural stuff that you can put on your face. So I grew up using oils and, and, and cleansing the skin with natural products, which really helped me and also because I didn't have any clue. But when I got a little older and when I moved to New York, I really started looking at skincare differently because you, you know, you get to shoot and you have a lot of makeup on and you're, you get your skin gets to break out. So I was like, okay, I have to get my together. So I had to like learn about products. So now I have like a skincare routine that I've been using for over five years. So. That's, that's it. I'm gonna wash this cleanser off. Again, get the towel out. And so we're gonna go to step three. I just washed all the cleanser off. And step three, I use this lovely hydrating mist by Epicurrent. And this is such a great product because I travel so much and my skin gets so dry. So I have this in my bag. It's like a small little, and I'm literally always just spraying. Spray the hair as well. Ooh, nice. After that, we're gonna go to step four and that's the Bulgarian Rose by Epicurin. I love this oil. It smells so good. It's refreshing. So you do a little pump of that. Oops. And again, massage the skin. And then I have something very special that I use. Again, always get the neck. 
and I have a special tool. It's called the Epic Skin Tool. Uh, what it does, it just helps promoting the skin product and it helps with a deep penetration. So it makes sure that the product really goes in the skin. So I just like to rub it in like that. And then you go from up to down just for the circulation of the blood. So I do this. It's like a massage, but also it just helps the product go in there. So I normally do this for like two minutes and then as you can see, I'm good. So other stuff that I do for my skin is I do go to facials. I try to go once a month. I love doing it because it's so comforting. It feels good when someone is just like massaging your skin and using the right product. And other than that, I love, as I said, like using natural products. So I make my own masks. One of my favorite masks is honey and saffron. And I mix that together. And I do that like once to two weeks. It's just great to use natural products. I like look in my fridge and I'm like, okay, what's in there? What can I use? <laughs> Next product is the Moisture Surge by Epicurin. And it's a lightweight gel. It has hyaluronic acid. Again, massage it in the skin. Also, as you can see, I use a lot of Epicurin products because they're just so great for my skincare. Next step, we're gonna go to the Ole Henriksen Banana Bright Cream. This is one of my favorite products. As you can see, it's almost gone. But again, this is a great one. So I apply this under the eye, a little bit on top. What's so great about it, it's the vitamin C and it really just helps after being tired and you got a lot of bags under your eye. This is the product that you need. It helps with dark circles and it helps brighten the skin under the eyes. Next up is the Colostrum Luminous Glow Cream. <laughs> Oh, I love this cream. It's super light. I mean, at the end of the night, you don't want too much on your skin. I love to massage this in, give myself a little massage, you know? You can just use your hands. Next up, we're gonna use the Sugar Lip Polish by Fresh. You just kind of massage it in. So I make sure I scrub the lips and wash it. And then I normally just put on a little lip balm. This one is a strawberry lip balm by Smits. So apply the lip balm on the lips. Next step, I love to do this, especially right now since my hair is braided and the scalp needs some love too. So I use this really nice strengthening treatment oil. I just put, apply a little bit on my hands and then I put it on my fingertips and then I like to just kind of massage it in. I mean, the braids are kind of tight, but it really helps the hair grow and everyone knows me for my hair. It's big and you don't know how much work I have to do for all of that hair every morning. So this is great because I like wake up, I shower, voila, it's braided. I don't have to do anything. Next is this Tilt Mania and it's kind of a really nice, oh, it smells so good. It's a hand scrub. I like to make sure my hands are nice and moist as well before going to bed. So you just like rub it in. It smells amazing. Ugh! And then we wash it out. So after washing it out, I love to put a hand cream. This is the Peptide Rich by Epicurin. Again, Lovely smell. Smell is very important. I like more natural smells. I don't like to overdo it. Um, I mean, like having a candle, incense, rose oil. I think those are my kind of favorite smells. 
All right, I think that's it. And then maybe like the last step is this Kaya Jungle Firming Oil by Costa Brazil. I just like after a shower, after scrubbing the skin in the shower, I love to put this oil on my skin. I'm gonna just apply it on my neck and shoulders, elbows. My skin is super dry. So I love using oils. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've learned something and I'll see you guys another time. Bye-bye.